like everybody to be direct your attention down here to the front straightway as uh, we have a uh, very good way to start off tonight's uh, event with our opening ceremony and a presentation of a brand new American flag. Turn the step high, we're like, driver number 40, military handgun, and we just saw for the first time we come out here back after the run and has been killed. June bug. Okay. You want one of these potatoes? Huh? You want one of these potatoes? Okay. Yeah. I was never called in. Originally, he was supposed to be in at about one o'clock. No, no, that was never scheduled. Oh, originally, that was be in at one o'clock today. We, we made that up from. He had to take a cab from the airport in Saline to Austin, the air because they're plane broke. Your plane broke? Oh, it, it, it never came. It is like malfunctioned or whatever. So they. So they Offered us a ride to Austin. So he got in a little after five and settled one o'clock this afternoon. Oh my gosh! And you were never supposed to come in on Friday? Never. That was a front the whole time. Oh my god! You all I'm looking at Oh. 
Well, thinking he was on deck to take to the mat, a Greenville County High School wrestler was in for quite the surprise. That's right. He had no idea yeah. that his seaman brother was home for a very short trip, and their emotional reunion was really something else. As the Woodmont High School wrestling tournament gets underway. I thought I was about to have a match. I thought I was going to hit super rest. At first, I just thought he was wanting me to work tables or something. Wrestler Jesse Royal and his brother Taylor made their way to the front. I didn't know until he, like, until I saw him. I didn't I had no idea. It wasn't until these two turned around that they realized the oldest of their trio, Russell, was home. I was shocked. I was like, I had no idea. I thought he was still in Japan. After a few days in Virginia, Russell and his parents arranged the surprise homecoming. Eight, almost nine months since I've seen him. You know, I used to be a wrestler myself, and you know, I was, you know, they, I heard his tournament was today, so that's pretty much what I wanted to do. It's been a long time since I've seen him, so I'm pretty happy that he's here to support me. And while a hug may not be your standard wrestling move, in this case, tears of joy are welcome. It's not every day I get to see, see him and give my family a big hug these days. So it's like it's, it's a, you know, very, basically it's like something new to me. And I, it's very touching to be able to have my family in my arms again. The younger Royals say their time apart from Russell is hard, but this unexpected reunion couldn't have been better. Oh, it's pretty cool. I feel kind of special. It's a little tough being away from any kind of family or anything like that. And, uh, you know, it's just uh, really good to be home. Now, Jesse and Taylor only have a brief visit with their big brother home. Seaman Royal is set to head back to Japan early next week. Who Conspirators. The conspirators. Yeah. You guys are in so much trouble. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. How cool. Very good. Uh huh.
You left Grandpa! Daddy sent you a big present. Come here. Look! Yeah, you better open it up. Here, I'll hold your... You open it up. Nope, it's a big, big present. Oh, hey, this is one of the scissors that I put them over there. Hold on. Good boy. What do you think it is? No. Should we open it up and see? Yeah. It's a desk. It's a snack. Okay, hold on. Okay, pull the flaps open. Pull these open. Pull them hard. I got you. <laughs> Happy birthday. So go change your clothes, you get to come home. Yes, right now. Hi, Dad. How you doing? I'm doing good. You? I miss you. I miss you too. <laughs> I was in gym, so don't worry about it. Yeah, we went and got Chris too. <laughs> wow. You happy? Uh-huh. Home for 15 days. Did I get you? Yeah. <laughs>
Yeah, we're all like...